Okay, so this is actually a really cool thing that Bandai is doing for global players right now. And it's not something that we haven't seen before, but it's very, very rare. So basically, they're giving us the option to vote for a couple of things that are going to be coming to the game in the near future. Uh, I believe it's one event and also one LR Extreme Z Awakening. And these should be global first releases, although it doesn't really matter that much because JP is most likely going to get it like a week or two after. But nonetheless, it's probably going to be global first, which is always exciting. And uh, all you got to do is go to the Dokkan Twitter page here, click on the link and vote for uh, which one you want. So the first thing we can vote for is, well, the question is, which one is the key to absolute strength? Link level up, link skill level up, or skill orbs? And what I'm assuming this means is that we're voting for a future event, which gives us a higher chance to increase our link levels for characters or get better skill orbs. And between the two, I mean, they're both good to have, obviously. Like, you want to be able to increase link levels easier, but you also want to have good skill orbs. But between the two, I would say a stage that boosts link level uh, increases is more valuable, like something like the uh, you know middle cooler stage from the Worldwide Celebration as a permanent event would be insane, right? And uh, as far as skill orbs go, I mean, at this point, I feel like we have a lot of different stages for skill orbs, uh, especially for like the specific categories. And uh, we also have Ultimate Clash, which, sorry, uh, we have Explosive Chain Battle, which gives a lot of skill orbs at once. So even though, once again, skill orbs are very valuable, I just think that a good link level increase stage, uh, you know, much better than like the Roshi stage we have right now, would be the better option. So between the two, I would definitely go for link skill level up here. And then the other one, which is super exciting, is which one would you like to Extreme Z Awaken first? Now keep in mind that of course both of them will be getting Extreme Z Awakenings sometime within the next 12 months most likely, but we're voting for which one we want first. And I mean realistically, it should probably be the Beerus and Whis because uh, they came out first. I mean, they literally dropped in 2018. Okay, that was like four years ago plus, right? Four plus years ago. So uh, they really need that Extreme Z Awakening. They're definitely very, very outdated at this point and, you know, a lot less usable, in my opinion, than the Super Saiyan God Goku, who came out in... 2019 for JP, 2020 for Global. So more recent and also, you know, better defense. Um, offensively, I think the Beerus actually hits harder, but just a more well-rounded unit in the Super Saiyan God Goku right now, right? But since it's a vote, since I get a choice, I mean, I gotta go for the Super Saiyan God Goku, man. It's, it's a pretty easy decision right there because... It's Super Saiyan God Goku. I mean, there's not much more to say. Like, Beerus is cool, Whis is cool, and I definitely want an Extreme Z Awakening for these guys. Eventually. But I don't really care about it as much as Godku getting that Extreme Z Awakening right now. So, uh, yeah, if it were up to me, which uh, in this case, you know, for the survey, it is up to me. I'm definitely gonna vote for the Super Saiyan God Goku just because it's a cooler unit. That, that's that's basically it. So, uh, guys, make sure you go vote. Make sure you go to the Dokkan Twitter page right here. Click on that little link. You know what? Let's just do it on camera here. Uh, okay, so it says, We would appreciate if you could cooperate with us to answer the questionnaire below. Uh, one, which one is the key to absolute strength? I'm going to go link skill level up. And then for which one would you like to extreme Z Awaken first? I'm going to go Legend Reborn Super Saiyan God Goku. You click confirm, and uh, oh, you go to register at the bottom here. And that's it. Thank you very much for your cooperation to answer our questionnaire. Done. Very easy. Took me about, I mean, it would have taken me less time if I wasn't talking, but it'll take you like 10 seconds, right? So make sure you go vote. You don't have to vote the same thing as me. You know, it's totally up to you. But in my opinion, a better link level stage is just more valuable versus a new skill orb stage 
and uh, you know between the two I mean I just want that god coup right now now uh, I've seen some arguments that like if you vote for one then it'll delay the extremes the awakening for the other and you know that one will become better when it releases because it's gonna be a later release right and I do understand that thinking and concept or in theory right but uh, I'm pretty sure they've already completed both Extremes of Awakenings at this point, so I don't think it's going to change the details if, uh, you know, we vote for one and then delay the release of the other one. That's just how I feel. I could be wrong. Maybe, uh, you know, they'll... S <sighs> no, they're not going to start making the details right now, though. So most likely, because they give us the option to vote, um, I'm going to say, yeah, both of these Extremes of Awakenings are already done, right? They're just like trying to see like which one gets more votes to, to drop which one first, right? So, um, yeah, both of these EZAs probably already completed, so the details won't really change if we, you know, delay the release of one over the other. So just go for the one you want more, man. Go for the one that excites you more. Go for the one that uh, you want to see Extreme Z Awaken first and use first. Uh, for me, that's definitely Super Saiyan God Goku. If it's Beerus and Whis for you, that's fine as well. Totally, totally your call. So... Uh, yeah, guys, that's all there is to say in this video. Um, I love the fact that they're giving us the option to vote for things. I hope it becomes a, a staple going into the future because it, it's, it's just fun to have like a, a say in what we see in the game, right? And they did say in the past that they wanted to give us more of a voice, give the player base more of a voice, and this is definitely a step in the right direction, you know what I mean? So... Um, that's it. That's the video. Let me know in the comments which one of these you guys voted for, for the ECAs and also for the, uh, stage thing with the Bulma. And, uh, yeah. Thank you for watching, guys. Hope you enjoyed the video. As always, if you liked today's video, then make sure to like the damn video. Sub to the channel if you're new. Hit that notification bell so that YouTube knows you want to stay up to date with all my latest content. And until next time, have an awesome, awesome day. I'm Tiger. With Tiger, Uppercut Media, signing out.